We have three guava trees on the in the backyard, but um, for some reasons they're not fruiting yet. I hope we'll get some fruits this coming year. I don't see any flowers there. I've had it now for um, maybe six to seven years, but amazing because. This trees died because we have neglected it when they when we went to um, spend some longer time overseas. So isn't it amazing? Look at this beautiful flower, yellow weed flower. There's the other guava tree. No flowers yet. This one here is starting to become like a jungle here, so I'm gonna. I will have to cut down some of this big leaves. The cherry tree is getting some more leaves. It will be beautiful under this tree in summer and that is why I rearranged the, I transferred all the seats here on the table. We enjoy eating out here. I love it. I love this tree. Um, in the middle of uh, the garden. <coughs> well, look at this. Isn't it amazing how uh, 
probably succulent change change in appearance but they are but it's it's shooting up from the same these are all different but they I don't know maybe because of they've been there for so long they decided to change who knows mother nature is amazing evolving all the time that one this one here even this one here when I bought them when I bought it it's all only one round round uh, thing like that but look they're all going like uh, becoming longer they also have changed in appearance weird and this one here I have neglected it so just to be um, I used to keep it in the front yard but you know uh, I thought um, it might get bigger here become a lot more more healthier under the cherry tree the other ones are bigger this one here see healthier yes and that's jet there You know, actually, it's um, the aroma of uh, fresh bay leaves is a lot stronger than the dried ones. Of course. Oh, what did you do? Leaking. Leaking? It's amazing how these um, lavenders are... are flowering all year round maybe because of the bees really they helped look we have this base always busy every day it's amazing I've never seen these lavender bushes flower so much they normally die out and um, come back in um, spring but all summer, all the months of summer, they are like that. So the bees are very busy. Beautiful. This is another orange tree. Is this the orange tree or the li the lime? I think it's the lemon or lime. Lime. The other one is orange, you right? What one? Which one is the I I reckon this is the lime and that's the orange. Remember we had an orange in the pot? And then we decided to Orange or lemon? No, remember. we don't have lemon. But I'm going to... Because you put in another lemon, it's either that one or that one. No, no lemon. I'm telling you. So what about the orange then? You have a mandarin tree. Mandarin, but remember we have, we have an orange in a pot that has very nice... I think this is the orange one and this is the lemon, uh, the lime. This one is the lime. Apricot tree is uh, thriving as well. Um, I hope we get a lot of fruits this year. And here, Greg planted three different uh, varieties of potatoes. 
I mean, I'm at two different variety of uh, sweet potato and one um, just the one kind of uh, just the normal potato. I hope the purple potato will give us a lot and we'll just keep keep on planting. This is the peach tree. This peach tree is really yummy. Nice, big and sweet. Look at that, so much. We pruned it and then uh, it's healthier. See, that's what you do with uh, fruit trees. After they finish fruiting, you have to prune them down heavily so that they can come back a lot healthier. So anyway, I'm going to start my gardening now. Lemon, I don't really like this lemon. So we'll, because this lemon, it has very thick skin, rough thick skin. I would like to have the one that has a lot more smoother. They are more juicier lemon. So this one here, we might have to cut, cut this down to make it just smaller and we'll plant another kind of lemon the one with very thin skin the calamansi that I pruned heavily about four weeks ago um, there are some fruits are coming so I think they will get bigger because it has been thinned out. It's better for it. Okay. I really have to go and uh, start my gardening. <laughs>